Now I am going to talk about the list of dinosaur genera that are found in India. The first is Alvalcaria. It was a basal Saurischian dinosaur from the Maleri formation of Godavari Basin, Andhra Pradesh. This dinosaur is of late Triassic period. It was bipedal and looked like theropod. Although Sankar Chatterjee originally classified it as a basal theropod, but now it is considered as a basal Saurischian, which include both theropod and sauropod. It might be a omnivore as it has a heterodon dentation, that means more than one kind of teeth. It is also interesting to know that this animal might be the ancestor of sauropods. This Alvalcaria was discovered by Shankar Chatterjee in 1974. And now the only known specimen is in Indian Statical Institute, Kolkata, or ISI Kolkata, with catalog number ISI R306. Second dinosaur is Prathania. This is a mesospondylate sauropodomorph dinosaur from the Dharmaram formation of India. This animal is from early Jurassic period and known only from the fragmentary remains and supposed to be of 13 feet in length. These dinosaurs were much like platosaurs uh, and these were the uh, these were the prosauropods, a kind of prosauropods, and that means uh, dinosaurs that are in between the basal saurischian and the sauropod dinosaurs. Basal saurischian they contain uh, meat-eating dinosaurs that are theropods, theropods that like Tyrannosaurus rex and the uh, Rajasaurus, Majingasaurus, Raptors, as well as the sauro the long-necked sauropod dinosaurs. And this is the lineage in between the basal saurischian dinosaurs that comprises both sauropod and and the theropod. And this is specifically between the sauropod and the basal saurischian. Third is Jaclapallisaurus. It is a platosaurid of late Triassic. Fossils are from Andhra Pradesh. Various samples are recovered from the Gondwana basins of India. And here in this picture you can see, although this is not a reconstruction of a Jaclapallisaurus because I have not found any reconstruction of this animal, but it was a platosaurid, so it must be looking like a, a platosaur, uh, and must be looking like a platosaur, which was a prosauropod. As you can see here, that they have a long neck like a sauropod, but they can walk in two legs. Okay, like any theropod dinosaur. So they are the we can see the stage between or group of dinosaurs that are in between the sauropod and the basal saurischian dinosaurs. Then we have Lamplugosaurus. It is a basal sauropod dinosaur of early Jurassic period. This animal is also from Dharmaram formation, known from several fragmentary bones. This animal was about 10 meter, that is 33 feet in length. Although in this diagram it is shown like a prosauropod dinosaur, but it was more like a sauropod rather than a prosauropod. It was actually a basal sauropod, much like a Barapasaurus or Cotasaurus. Then we have Nambalia. Nambalia is a basal sauropod morph from Gondwana Basin, late Triassic. The holotop, uh, holotype specimen is ISI R273 recovered from upper Maleri formation within the Pranhita Godavari Basin or the PG Basin from Nambal village Andhra Pradesh. The generic name is after the village from which from where it is being discovered that is Nambal. Number six Kotasaurus. It was a basal sauropod of early Jurassic period. It is discovered from the Kota formation of Telangana village Yamanpalli. Fossil data of this genus is rich. 
it has 840 skeletal parts but no skull has ever been recovered and this is a reconstruction of a skeleton of a Kotasaurus in a Birla Museum Hyderabad number seven Berapasaurus Berapasaurus was a basal sauropod of early Jurassic period Kota formation discovered from the Nalgonda district, district of Telangana this dinosaur shares some habit same habitat as with Kotasaurus so Kotasaurus and Berapasaurus are of same time and they are sharing the same habitat that means they are found in same area known from more than 300 bones of six individuals and even in this case skull is missing the skull, is, uh, skull of this genus is never been recovered the genus name Barapasaurus comes from Hindi words bara that means bara which means big pa means leg it means big leg lizard Barapasaurus there is only one species of this genus and this species name is named after Ravinath Tagore and this species name is Tagori this is a reconstruction of a Barapasaurus number 8 Dundakasaurus this dinosaur is from early Jurassic it was a theropod and it was recovered from the Andhra Pradesh it was supposed to be look like a ceratosaurus and here in this image we have an image of a ceratosaurus as I have not found any reconstruction or any image of the of this genus so uh, according to the right uh, papers this uh, this this dinosaur is much like a ceratosaurus and this is a ceratosaurus known from a partial pubis and hence this genus is nomen, uh, nomen dubium that means scientists are not very sure about whether this genus is actually a genus or it is a material from a animal that we already know number nine dryptosaurides this is a late cretaceous theropod and possibly albedosauridae this albedosauridae group of dinosaurs they can uh, they include majungosaurus and rajasaurus known from six caudal vertebrae that are shown here which were recovered from the bara shimla hill of jabalpul madhya pradesh from the lameta formation but this genus is also nomen dubium as these bones are nearly indistinguishable from other specimens that are found in the same locality number 10 endosaurus it is a late cretaceous albedosaurida theropod dinosaur like rajasaurus majungasaurus this dinosaur is also known from the lameta formation jabalpur known from the holotype specimen that is GSI K27-565 Indosaurus may have horns above, his, uh, above its eyes according to some paleontologists Indosuchus and Camposuchus should be merged in the genus Indosaurus number 11 Indosuchus late Cretaceous albedosauridae theropod dinosaur this dinosaur look similar to the endosaurus and it is a relative of uh, rajasaurus it too had a crusted head although the crusted head is very common in albedosauridae known from three skull material recovered from the lameta formation jabalpur district madhya pradesh and as mentioned earlier endosuchus can be merged and the Indosaurus according to some scholars number 12 Comsosuchus it is a late Cretaceous albedosauridae theropod dinosaur from the holotype known from the holotype specimen 
GSI K27-578. This, uh, this genus is nomen dubium and according to some scholars this can be merged into Indosaurus.